Catholic Diocese. Early this morning, the Pope appointed a new leader. 41 Action News anchor Amy Hawley is live where the new bishop just spoke. Amy. Can you believe, can you imagine getting a phone call from Pope Francis? Well, that is exactly what happened to the newly appointed bishop here of the St. Joseph Kansas City Diocese downtown. The announcement was made just a few minutes ago, and he said he received that important phone call and appointment from Pope Francis just a few days ago. His name is Bishop James Johnston, Jr. He could have said no, but he told me today, coming to the Scandal Rock Diocese here in downtown Kansas City, he believes is his calling from God. The 55 year old comes from Cape Girardeau, Missouri. He's a former engineer who became a priest back in 1990. He will continue to lead that Saint, that Springfield Cape Girardeau diocese until his November 4th installation. He succeeds Robert Finn, the bishop, the former bishop who resigned back in April, nearly three years after being convicted of failing to report suspected child abuse by a priest. The newly appointed bishop told me today he didn't know a lot about the situation, but would be very diligent in learning more. And although he wasn't a part of that scandal that caused so much upheaval in the Kansas City area for three years, he said two words so many victims and parishioners have been waiting to hear and want to hear from a new bishop. I'm sorry. So tonight, we will be talking to the victims, victims' families, and those advocacy groups that we've talked to for the last three years to hear what their reaction about this new appointment is. In downtown Kansas City, Amy Holly, 41 Action News.